All right, Tommy Cowett here from Growing Green Lawn Care on the lawn, and we're looking at a peculiar problem with some turf disease, or actually, it's not really a disease. I'll show you what I'm talking about here. This is a lawn. Um, it's actually one of our technician's properties, and it's tall fescue, and as you can see, he's a little concerned about this bronzing color that you see, and this is not a uh, pathogenic disease, but it is a um, organism called Helminthosporum, and it's really a, more of an aesthetic problem. It's not killing the disease, the lawn. It's actually causing some yellowish discoloration, and I can show you some leaves that I pulled up. These are the uh, just typical, this is what's going on down on the sward. These are your older leaves, and they're sloughing off they have a mortality, they do die. So what is going on here on the lawn is as these leaves get older, they will die off. And this is a more of a necrophyte type of um, fungus, the Helminthosporum. It actually uh, is a decayer. It's eating, <laughs> so to speak, some of the older tissue and it's a good thing for the lawn, actually, because it's a decomposer, and it's going to help break down those grass clippings into organic matter and refeed the lawn. Now, what will happen here, it's been raining a lot lately. Uh, it's been a nice, cool spring. So what has happened is a, the shoot mortality has been a lot lower. Uh, these leaves have tended on the tall fescue plant to hang on much longer. Uh, than they normally would under a hotter season, but we've had a really cool mild spring with a lot of rain so they, They've really held on longer and now when we've started getting some higher temperatures. They're all pretty much going at once um, I could probably see, you'll see over on that area. It's a little greener. It's probably a lot uh, a little more shade in that area so the lawn didn't get stressed out as much as this Full sun area did which led to this now so this is Helminthosporum and like I said it's not a pathogen it's not something we would control with a fungicide this lawn is treated for brown patch with a with fungicides so as you can imagine he was very concerned but anyway thought I'd share that with you hope that was helpful and uh, Tommy Cowett from Grown Green signing out